Well, some residents of the Hillbrook Estates in Orange are upset by a proposed public housing project. The Housing Authority plans to build the new public housing unit down the road from Hillbrook off Sykes Road. Fox 4's Lauren Hewitt reports residents have different reactions to the project, and that's our top story tonight. Monica Garrett and her husband have lived in Hillbrook Estates for 28 years. She says some of her neighbors are worried about their property values decreasing, but she's not. As long as our neighborhood remains safe, that's all I care about. Um, and I feel quite certain that they will choose people that deserve a step up, a helping hand. Garrett says she and her husband have had many opportunities and she wants others to have them too. They could have had something happen in the middle of their life where they lost everything. And I know if I lost everything, I'd want there to be somebody there to help me. Another resident feels differently. My concern about the project is for the children that are directly across the street. Didick doesn't want the project built next to Community Christian School. These children and adults and teachers are at da in danger of having the hardest criminals in the city of Orange put right here across the street from a school. The assistant chair of the Housing Authority Board says they've owned this plot of land for about 20 years, and it's one of the few locations that meets the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development's requirements to grant federal funds. Our original plan was to rebuild on the, the sites that we already had. That uh, the money was not available to do that because of the, the criteria set for how it could be spent. Combs says he hopes the new housing improves the neighborhood. We are having some requirements for people that can that even get a chance to live there. I don't know all of them. A couple of them are is that you have to either be working, have a job, or be a full-time student. In Orange, Lauren Hewitt, Fox 4 News. The Housing Authority will also use federal funds to rebuild the old Pine Grove Public Housing Complex and add on to the Velma Jeter Public Housing Unit.